Hey guys, I'm Nick Meister, and welcome back to Let's Play Hitman Absolution. Next up is Hunter and Hunted. And it's a long chapter, so sit back and relax as we uh, play through this game. And it's still raining. You're right. The arms dealer is after Victoria. I need to stop him before he gets too close. Man, he already too close. You want my advice? You take that girl and you run. I never did believe in running. Really, you never believed in running, huh? Because that's what assassins do. They just stand out in the Gordon, open. my sources. Girl is in Chicago. Me and the boys What's are What's that guy doing? He's ruining the fucking I table or something. The operation. What's are that? What is Wade. that? I heard you. Oh, it's a chicken bone. You want bomb. me to snatch some chick? Name's Victoria. Dom is gonna call you, tell you how to find her. She's in hiding somewhere. You got that? That's a lot of hassle for one chick. <laughs> she must be. He <laughs> slashes and braces, douchebag. I need to bring my boys. That means double my fee. Mm. Ugh. Take Gross. Lenny with you. He can bring her back when you find her. Maybe Lenny, she wear boxers Lenny instead of a pulling on, on his my dick. feet. <laughs> Sorry, the kid's a dipshit. Twenty-five. Thirty-nine. Twenty-six. Thirty-seven. Thirty. Thirty-five. Deal. Hmm. Lenny, come give the man a line. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's hilarious. <laughs> Douche. <laughs> Come on, Limp Dick. <laughs> Limp Dick Lenny. <laughs> Shut up. I don't know why, but I really like the way he delivers that line. Limp Dick I Lenny. Like that old I really do. Son of a bitch makes my skin crawl. Oh, that's probably why I like him. <laughs> now, Blake Dex is a ruthless son of a bitch for sure, but the guy you really need to worry about is the business partner, Tom Osman, owner of the Vixen Club over on Bristol Street. This prick is bad new homes, even by my standards. I mean, he's clever and really connected. And it's only a matter of time before he tracks down your girl at the orphanage. What? How do you know about that? Hey, Chicago knows I know. He knew Victoria was at the orphanage. That That's not good. his picture. All right, so apparently, uh, oh. Now, since every cop in Chicago is hot on your ass, the safest route to the Vixen Club should be through the tunnels next to the Roxy. Good luck, Holmes. <clears throat> the tunnel next to the Roxy. Okay. So, like I was saying before, this is a long chapter. I wouldn't be surprised if, after the extra content I put in, this video is over an hour long. But, well, that's Hitman Absolution for you. You see, it's the girls you have to worry about. The boys will get on. Runaways, junkies, mostly. A girl needs looking at. These girls, the devil takes them. Takes them to Hawaii. Place. I don't think Hawaii's that bad. I was there once. I mean, the locals weren't that friendly, but I, the weather was nice. Uh, I pray to St. Anthony and the Holy Mother. Blessed be her name. I pray to them. I pray for the lost, the missing, the vanished. Well, that's nice, but you could also try, you know, looking for them. That might help. All right, so I think that guy has another line, but he doesn't always say it, so uh, I'm just going to move along here because, like I said, we've got a long road ahead of us. I did consider splitting this level up into more than one video, but the problem with that is that assuming I do one video per chapter, we got about 20 videos, which means I'll be playing this game for about four months. And I don't know if my psyche can take place. playing this game for four months. And, and that's assuming I do a video every week, which isn't always easy. So, yeah. I'm just going to head in here. And, whoa. God, holy fucking shit. 
Hey, I found something. I don't think you have to tell anybody anything. I think you need to go to sleep. That's what you need to do. There we go. Alright, so... You know, originally I was gonna sneak through this this level. Um, as, as wearing a suit. But, uh... Actually, you know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna do it. There we go. <clears throat> I was gonna put him in here. There we go. Try not to get gangrene or whatever. So, uh... I suppose this is the work of the homeless man? Maybe? I don't know. Does he seem like a guy who's kind of capable of putting all these candles up here? Maybe not, but he definitely says prayers here, I suppose, right? There's also a gun. I wonder if that was a police officer's gun? I don't know. Who cares? Um, yeah. So, let's move along. Make sure this guy doesn't see us. Just gonna head over here. And... There we go. Nice, he didn't see us. That sure was stealthy, wasn't it? Now let's, uh, let's head over here. Wow, it sure is shiny. And let's hit the checkpoint. Boom! Checkpoint. And... Before I continue with the sneaking, I gotta go over here. Show you another option. It's really only good if you're wearing the police outfit. But, uh... There is a nice little conversation over here. I guess. If you're into that kind of thing. Hey, uh, I see a bald, white, middle-aged man uh, last couple hours. Uh, I who has more than you to from the rest of the Hello? Anyone home? Therefore, let's bring it not forth. Let's bring it not forth the good fruit, Dad. It's you, Jesus Christ. Look, sir, uh, Reverend, is it? Parson. Yeah. We're only trying to protect you, right? You're not in any trouble. We just, uh... This man, he's, uh, he's very dangerous. No, no, he will, he will gather the wheat. He's, he's gone. <laughs> what is that? Yeah, yeah. Burn. Fire sentence. Come on. A bull guy with a bunch of guns coming through here or what? Give me a nod. That's all I need. Yes or no? The chap, the chap. He will burn the fire. Mm, that's quite a sermon there. I'm serious. You know it's a felony to obstruct justice, uh, right, asshole? Can't hey, believe him in this hey, fucking calm down. game. He's just uh, you know, a little nuts. But he could be our best lead. We don't know. No, no. Crazies like him, you just gotta decipher what they're saying. <laughs> yeah, oh, right. No. Yeah, right. Just gotta. Alright. Actually, I'm gonna try something I don't normally do. Um. Let's see if it works. Probably not, but, uh... Oh, uh, nope, didn't work. Um, I'm gonna head down here. And hopefully they'll forget about everything they've seen. Mm, wow, there sure are a lot of cigarette butts in here. wonder if they're all from different people, or if they're from one person who just did a lot of smoking, huh? And they're all doing action poses with their guns. I wonder if I can sneak high. Oh! Whoa! Hello. That was fucking amazing, huh? Um... But it's not going to be easy. Well, I got some crazy holy roller down here, and I think he's seen something. But he ain't talking. No, no, let me clarify. He's talking, but he ain't talking sense. <laughs> All you have to yeah, do is decipher uh, what he's saying. Need some serious meds before we get any sense out of him. But, uh, we'll keep on. Really, dude? You're going to keep talking to that guy? Come on. Come on. 
Right, so sneaking through here, I remember the first time I tried, I was doing it on extreme, so I think there were even more guards. And it was at that point I realized just how ridiculous this game is. I guess what you can try to do is stick close to these, uh, um, these, uh, these cars here. And I gotta wait for this guy with a shotgun to head to the right. Not sure what this guy on the left's gonna do, since I've never actually let him get that far before. And, oh, Jesus. Let's see if I can... Oh, man. Hey, I was giving up. Why'd you fucking try to punch me? Ah, oh, there. And... I'm gonna try to fight my way out of this. Never successfully done that before. But, this is the first time for everything. God, there's so many of them. Damn. Fuck. I need a guy's shotgun. Die, die! Thank you. I gotta say, uh... The shooting in... Shit. I get my ass kicked. Um, die. Actually, I have a better idea. Rather than getting myself killed. I'm going to take this guy's outfit. There we go. What? What? Come on. What? Who saw me? Oh, shit. Alright, and we're back. Finally managed to sneak through. And here we are. So, yeah. Fuck Hitman Absolution. Fuck it forever. And here we are at the Vixen Club. It's a fun little stage, I think. I guess. I don't know. There's two ways to approach uh, the Vixen Club. We can go down here and sneak through a, a great... But it's kind of fucking pointless because you don't really even need to sneak into the club. Uh, the bouncers don't even make you pay the cover for some reason. Even though they give another guy a real hard time about it. Why? Why? Hawaii, huh? Seems to be a repeating theme in this stage, huh? Girls doing their free time? Not our fucking problem, man. It's just a bunch of fucking whores to you guys. No conscience, huh? With tits and ass in your face every night? <laughs> Ain't no room in this brain for a conscience. <laughs> yeah, what do we look like Santa's elves protecting the North Pole? This ain't a fucking nice business. This ain't a nice fucking neighborhood. Well, that's one way to put it. So, up here is probably the best way, in my opinion, to enter the Vixen Club because uh, we get some nice things. And no, I'm not talking about the evidence. I'm talking about this key card, very useful. And this baby right here, nice. Silenced Jag Pistol, very useful. Finally, you have to stop fucking around with the choking wire and the unsilenced revolver. I'll put that back. Okay, so let's head down here into the club. Titties, you gotta pay. Oh, come on, man. Hank knows me. Hank always comps my entrance. Come on. Hank here? You know Hank? Hank knows me. I don't need fucking Hank, all right? Listen, I got a better idea. You get the hell out of here and come back when you got some dough, all right? Don't waste my fucking time. All right, all right, fine. But could you do me a big favor? Could you give Amber a message for me? Oh, sure, Amber, right. Hey, you got a pen so I can write that down? That's very important. Get the fuck out of here. <sighs> all right, all right. Go home to my fucking bitch wife now. <laughs> but, you know, this guy 
doesn't seem to mind that we haven't paid. And we look like a fucking homeless person. You don't mind if we uh, go in, do you? Hey, how you doing? Hey, what's up? No, you don't mind at all? Alright. Maybe they just don't like that guy. Hmm. The Vixen Club. Oh, God, this plastic is so shiny. Let's see here. Show dates. Oh, wow. Hey, I wonder if they mean next March or the March I missed. Hmm. And, uh... <laughs> that girl on the right there has a hilarious face. Uh, let's see. Tiffany, a real woman. Hmm. Now remember, when you get inside the Vixen Club, look toward the bar. Because Dom, he likes to be where the action is. Alright, I guess the bar has a lot of action. Sure is happening in this place. Huh? Oh, there's Dom. Hey boys, it's happy hour on all spirits. What? Jeez, that looks dirty. What are you doing? Hey, Joe! We're running out of beer! Can you go down to the cellar? Joe, can I get some help behind here? Okay, look at my credit card. This is really weird. Okay, well, just remember. And Dom was threatening that bouncer guy. I don't know what he's saying. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Alright, so, uh. I gotta hurry the fuck up because, uh. I don't know if you guys know this, but a couple months after the game came out, I think, there was a patch released. Now, the main thing this patch did was it uh, made it so that hard, extreme, and purest difficulties had longer reaction times for the guards. Oh, here he comes. And this is going to make our job killing Dom very, very, very easy. Uh, right, so. Um, what was I saying? Okay, so. Normally, before the patch, I could come in here, and this this location here wouldn't be trespassing at all. It would not be trespassing. So, I could actually stand in here, uh, as this lady gave her dance to Dom. And then kill him right in front of her, and she wouldn't react at all. And I don't know why that happened. Uh, if you check out some early videos of the stage, you can see it in action. Um... In order for me to do that, I think I'd have to reinstall the game without the patch or something, but I'm not going to go through all that trouble. It's Dom. I'm sending up a new girl. Yeah, Wade is going to go apeshit for this one. Did you prep the Hawaii room? Oh, shit. Make sure there's, there's that Hawaii again. Spare no expense. Oh, and some smoked salmon. Wade's really into that. Only the best for my buddies, right? <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna tap you right now. All right, and it really couldn't be easier. Silence pistol shot through the the glass. Doesn't suspect the thing. Here we go. And we already have a key card, so I'm gonna leave that where it lies. You don't know how big of a favor I just did you, lady. A huge favor. A gigantic favor. Alright. Hey, man, what's up? Uh, yeah, hey. And here's a checkpoint. There we go. I'm gonna wait for this guy to turn around. There's that Good fucking bin. Head right on in. Take a load off. Yeah, he's not talking about back here, because technically we're not allowed back there. That's just one of those generic NPC phrases that he has. Alright. Okay. And we could just head to the right. Oh. hi -ya. I wasn't expecting this guy to be here. But that was good that he was. And I'm gonna take your outfit. Because I am sick and tired of sneaking around. Or worse. Fucker did the same thing to Amber with a billy club instead of a hairbrush. Who's Amber? Oh, God. Why is this happening? I mean, I mean look outside. 
There are cops everywhere. And, and you know what? He doesn't give a flying fuck. That's why he cops all the cops. They are not about to fuck with him when he gives them free titties every night. I think it's sick. I mean, we're just working. Look, be smart, be safe, and put a brave face on, or Dom will send you straight to Hawaii. <laughs> Why would that be bad? Well, yeah. you seen the sign on the door upstairs? The one that's always locked? Believe me, it's bad. Now let's get back to work. Sheesh. Doesn't seem like a very safe place to strip. All right. Hey, where the hell are you from? Nice a little personal space? Good. Huh? What? Oh, what? What's up with these drawings? It, do all these strippers have kids or something? I think that's what it's supposed to be, but I'm not really sure. <laughs> um, what else? Oh, right. I'm sure some of you know there's another way to kill Dom. And uh, I'll be showing that off, I think, either at the end of this section or at the end of the video itself. So stay tuned for that, too. Is there anything else around? Oh, here's another silenced pistol. Now we've got two pistols. Pew, pew! Nice. All right, so... I could have just gone straight up to the next part of the game, of the, sec of the, of the stage, of the level, but... You know, it's a let's play. I just wanted to show you guys a few things. So, all he really had to do was just head up these stairs here. Girls, girls, girls. And here we are. Let's pick the lock. Not sure what he's picking it with, but, well, there you go. And I don't know why the game stutters like that. There's absolutely nothing I can do about it. It just happens when you go between uh, sections of the level. Yeah, it was what was weird. Just said he was heading back to Chinatown. He never misses a Hawaii show. That's because he's a crazy fucking sick prick asshole. Okay, let's get back to work. I wonder what their work is tonight. I mean, not really doing anything. They're just, uh... And my little, my, my fucking Pedro fucked your chihuahua? Stealth action, ladies and gentlemen. Stealth action. And, uh, another depressing stripper conversation hey, hey. brought to you by Hitman Look, Absolution. You just gotta entertain his friends. Don't let them think they own you. And just think of something positive. We, we've all been there, honey. Luckily, they don't ask twice. <laughs> just tell me what happens in Hawaii. I mean, it's just... Well, you all say it's really bad. I mean, is it is it just like a private club? You know, like the Look back at 47 room? Yeah. in the mirror. He's like, yeah. Something like that. Looking but good. It's it's not something you really want to be a member of. Just just be strong, baby. Yeah, pretty girl. You show them how good you are, but just don't say yes to everything they say. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank That's you. such a bullshit thing Thank to say. You. I won't. You're you're I full won't. of shit, lady, and you too. Poor, 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 poor thing. Yeah. Ugh. So, whatever Hawaii is, it's not a great place. I'm starting to think that Hawaii isn't. Oh, right. And this lady here kind of reminds me of that woman from uh, uh, Ghost in the Shell, whatever her name is, Matoko or whatever. Yeah. Just thought I'd point that out. Whoosh. Stealth action. And 47 won't go upstairs while hugging hugging cover for some reason. I don't know why. Alright. I think this is the only guy up here. Let's try out our new pistols. Pew! Oh, shit. Someone hurt us. Let's see if we can hide this guy. Oh, wait, there is one more guy up here. Hmm. Well, let's put him in here. And, oh, damn it. Oh, well. Die, you fucking prick. Die. Die. Nice. <laughs> that was fun, huh? Alright, who's this fucking guy over here? 
What the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna murder you. Is that alright? Hiya! There we go. And, uh. Let's dump you over here. <laughs> Just for some laughs. <laughs> no one seems to notice. <laughs> that guy didn't notice the body either. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> Alright, so. There's not much to see here, really. There's a weird, kinky bed. With a camera, of course. It's kind of giving me flashbacks to Manhunt 2, you know? And I gotta say, I think I enjoy playing Manhunt 2 a little more than I'm enjoying playing this game, so. Yeah. Right. And here's. Oh, there's the door to Hawaii. Huh. Yeah, it's Wade. I sent some boys to grab that guy you call Birdie. He oh, really shit. is working with the hitman. We need his wings clipped now. You call me back when you got a lock on that girl. Dexter smells a fortune. I intend to get my fair share. I'll see you soon, old boy. Uh-oh, what's this? Oh, man, looks like they have more information on us than we thought. <clears throat> it's only a matter of time before they find Victoria. You were right. Dom was searching for Victoria. I got to shit. him just in time. Good for you, Holmes. He was on to you as well. A man is coming. A man named Wade. That guy's crazier than a shit house rat. You need to get your ass over here like right away. Sleep. <laughs> Cause this is about to get very loud and very messy. I have to call you back. All right. So it looks like Birdie's in trouble, and as a result, we're also in trouble. So uh. Need to get to that guy real quick. It's not letting me take cover at all. Oh, okay, there we go. There's a body in here somewhere. I just know it. I can't find anything. Ah, yeah, me neither. This place is a shithole. Yeah, exactly. That's why it's perfect. Look, all the clues here point to somehow the, the club is all part of it. I don't care if we find some old junkie's blood or a fucking piece of rotten chicken. You want to close the place down, huh? Hey, they're fucking parasites. They sell lives of these women. They sell their fucking souls. Hey, listen, I, uh, I don't know if you know, but it's one of the number one occupations for young female students, so they can uh, you know, get through college. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> yeah, I right. Support. That's a good cause. Working no, their yeah. way through so college. Way and that's an honest job. It's a shitty Come job. On, it's a shit job. Come yeah, on, let's just what right? I said. Hey, look, if titty dancing ain't illegal, I don't see the problem, right? I mean, more power to him, right? Excuse me, ladies. Aren't we supposed to be looking for a corpse or something? I know it's a shit job. I, I, I'm your boss. It's an honest job, but someone's got to do it. Mm. You've been giving this a lot of thought, huh? Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Relax, guys. We ain't gonna find jack shit by arguing about the merits of... Fucking Yeah, so it's a long ass conversation, and these incompetent jackasses can't seem to find one dead body in this whole fucking place. Well, maybe we can help them out. Oh, Jesus. That was close. If there's anything that ruins a let's play, it's getting fucking spotted. Ugh. What are you what are you looking for? Seriously, dude. What the what the fuck are you looking for? Does he think he's going to find like a tiny little body in the pile of trash? What's this? Oh. Holy shit. Are those are those like little stirrups for people's legs? Oh, gross. So I guess this is the Hawaii room, huh? Oh, whoa, whoa. whoa. What? Who could have possibly seen me? I'm stupid. Ugh, oh, God. Um, right, the Hawaii room, ladies and gentlemen. And don't want that guy to see me either. Oh, shit. Hi. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Right, so fucked up once, but I'm not gonna let that stop me. Um. So this guy over here, this fucking guy, 
is not gonna ruin my playthrough this time. No siree. That's it. Oh, you're not gonna come over here now, huh? Alright, fine, whatever, fuck you. Let's pick up the shotgun here. And, uh, I'm gonna head over here. Checkpoint. And, uh, like I was saying before, before I got interrupted, uh, these guys are having trouble finding a body. A body that they can use to shut down Dom Osmond's whole operation. And he's already dead, so I don't think they're... Ugh, God. So, here's their body. And I guess they didn't look hard enough, huh? There. So it's going to take a minute for all these guys to, to notice the dead body laying right there. And when they do notice it, they're all going to get out of our way. There we go. Oh, Jesus, don't fucking see me there. Okay, good. And, uh... These two unlucky guys gotta die, because they're in our way. You're dead, and you're dead. There we go. Okay. And I think I'm gonna take this guy's outfit, because honestly, I'm a little tired of sneaking around. There. There we go. Once again, one of Chicago's finest. Can you believe these guys? They missed that body. It was right there. You know? Alright. Let's get out of here. Bertie, I'm on my way back to Chinatown. Stay low and watch your back. Oh, yeah? Well, that's easy for you to say, Holmes. Man, that Wade... They say he got ways to make you talk. And you and I both know that I got a lot of shit to say. So, hurry! Just stay calm. <laughs> Easy for you to say, 47. Alright. So, uh... This is the convenience store. It's an interesting stage, by which I mean not interesting at all. But there are a lot of ways to approach uh, this place. The convenience store is right there. That's where we need to get to. And I could sneak, I could walk down the stairs there, but that requires a lot of instinct, which I don't really feel like using. No, no, I haven't seen anybody. Oh, they already know about Dom Osmond. I guess we gotta move fast. For a second there, I was afraid I was going to have to kill someone. Actually, I think we could use this guy's outfit more than we could use the police officer's outfit. Let's just take this guy's. There we go. There's two people we got to worry about here. There's the police, and there's... That was, uh... Ambitious of you? Well, I had to pee anyway. Three times a night now, I tell you, kid. Don't grow old and don't let your prostate swell. Yeah. Ugh, oh, ugh, oh, nice. <laughs> don't plan to, huh? I'm a live fast, die young kind of guy, okay? Wow. Well, then you're a damn fool. I'd say live in a moderate pace, die middle age. Preferably from a stroke on the golf course. Or in a hotel room snuggled between the titties of my secretary. <laughs> You don't have a secretary. It's just me. And I don't have tits. And you <laughs> don't play golf. Guy can dream, can he? Ooh. Sorry, buddy. You sure have mediocre dreams. Yeah? All right, smartass. How do you want to go? <laughs> you really want to know? In a plane crash at the age of 27, after my debut album goes number one, but right before I start recording that difficult second album. You know, so everyone will spend decades guessing whether I was a tragic genius or a one-hit wonder. Huh? Pretty good, huh? <laughs> oh, I see you put a lot of thought into this. I didn't even know you played. Oh, I, I don't. But, you know, I mean to. I'd like to, someday. Yeah, yeah. Life sure is a bit, huh? 
Um, I'm gonna put all you guys out of your pain. Right now. Boom. Yeah. Uh-oh. Looks like someone heard us. Uh-oh. So, I could light fireworks, that's normally what people do. I don't really feel like doing that. Uh, probably should have killed those guys, but whatever. Um, right, actually, fuck it, why don't we... Oh, shit. Really? Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Okay. Put your hands over your head. Maybe this can help us out. Maybe this can help us escape. And I went the wrong way. All right, so we're back, and I'm not going to needlessly murder anyone. Man, I'm soaked. All right. Um, right. Oh, I didn't even need to kill that guy. I could have just taken this outfit. All right. So, most people like to set off fireworks. I guess I'll do that too. Why not? Permit from the Chicago Fire Department. I mean, if if there's just one tiny spark in there, all the sprinklers are gonna go off. I be believe me. I promise you, everything is in order. And I'm just doing my job. You got a lot of firepower back there. Listen, if you see a man fit in that description, you let one of us know, right? You understand? Of course. Uh, of course I will. And they're still looking for us. Now, what most people do is they set off the, uh, the fireworks. I'm not really sure why we need to close this valve first. I guess that makes it smokier or something. No, that's because I like to play dress up, so I probably look like something else. And uh, we can set off these fireworks. There we go. And that ought to help us out. about are the other uh, the other convenience store workers hey, stop. Going somewhere? and we gotta get out of here quick there we go ah, fucking frustrating so this section here is I mean they don't even score you I don't think you're not looking at the right place. Yeah, duh. I'm not a fucking idiot. If I was Let's looking in the along, right sir. place, we could Please go business. home. I'm just saying, I can't find it. Huh? Find out what that was. Can I get you anything else while I'm up? A nice foot rub, maybe? Not really sure what this does, but... This shit is it does get at least one police officer out of our way. You, sir? I had it done. just wound up. And uh, really, the trickiest part about this this section is picking the lock without anyone seeing us. Oh, come on, come okay. on. oh, that worked out much better than I thought it would. So here we come to the last section of the stage, and probably the oh, funnest. Shit, they're here. Three weights, guys, and the crowd asking questions. It's only a matter of time before they see me. You gotta get me out of here, Holmes. You got to. You got to for your own damn good. Birdie, focus. Don't do anything foolish. I will take care of this. <clears throat> All right. So I guess Birdie sent us the killer's picture. There they are. 
So, uh, Chinese New Year, and we gotta kill three targets. God damn it, well. Hold on a second. It's a little too loud. It's driving me nuts. Okay. There, that's better. Alright, so. <laughs> there are three guys and three fun ways to kill them all. So that's what we're gonna do. Now, uh, hold on a second. I'm gonna go for this guy first. The guy in the, the rust colored jacket. And uh, he's here to find Birdie, and he's here to find the Hitman, but he's also here to do a little business on the side, and that's how we're gonna get him. Let's make a yeah. very important call. Yeah, no sign of Birdman yet. What? Then look, look, what do you want from me? It's freaking New Year down here. Yeah, yeah, I'll get back to you. Mr. Bill Dole. Nice glasses, jackass. You do know it's uh, like 10 o'clock at night, right? <laughs> Colleague, you around? Yeah. Over by the dance studio. Down the stairs. Now, we can't just walk in on the deal this guy's about to put on. No, 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 we can't do that. That'd be too easy. There's a police officer blocking the way, so we need to be a little sneakier. Right? Now, if you haven't noticed by now, this is the same stage from uh the first Chinatown level, the King of Chinatown, but there's some places that are open that weren't there before, like this spot here. I'm gonna climb through this vent, John McClane style. Hold on a second. There we go. Now that guy over there is gonna do our dirty work for us. I know it's not really 47 style per se, but it's a lot of fun. So this birdie's file. We we don't want to. Uh, we don't want uh, these guys to find Birdie's file. That would be bad for Birdie. That'd be bad for us. Uh, got there just in the nick of time. All right. What? Where's the file? Hey, what the hell? Where's that goddamn file? Where'd you fucking put it? Fine, though. It was lying right there. Look, jerk off. You're fucking bullshit me. Kill him. Here, but I want my goddamn money back. Hey, screw you. Who the hell All right, city boy. What the hell? Damn. Motherfucking quick draw McGraw right there. Laid him out. Nice. Jesus. Oh, no. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot, buddy. You did us a huge the favor there. Secure? Yeah, yeah. Look, look, we got a problem down here. What? No, no. The whole thing just backfired. I don't, I, I don't even know what. It's like it's like one minute the file was there, the next it was just gone. The guy freaked. What? He, he pulled a gun on me. What was I supposed to do, right? Look, we have to. Hey, shut up! You better believe it's a we thing. Now just get just get the red van around back. <coughs> we need to dump this guy in the river or something. I, I don't. Yes, again. Yeah, right. God. Jesus, fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah. One down, two to go. We'll wait for this guy to leave the room, and then we're gonna take a quick look around. I think Birdie's file counts as evidence, so for all you guys who care about points, there you go. Oh. This guy also had a silenced jag. Yeah. What else is here? Ooh, lots of ammo. Nice. An explosive. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna use that, but hey. And uh, some machine gun, but I'd rather have the shotgun. All right, so we're done here. Let's uh, head back out. Okay. This video is going to be a little bit shorter than what I've been playing. I've been fucking up a lot, restarting a lot. Now, our next target is Mr. Larry Clay. He's right over here. And uh, he's going to try to interrogate this poor fellow over here. Hey, 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 you. Yeah, 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 you. That's right. Come here for a moment. Yeah, come on. That's right. Much of Come on. 
So, one thing to note is that these guys are Wade's guys, and Wade is from somewhere. Oh, right. Um, quick note, that guy that we had get shot by the police officer, Bill Dole. We can also wait for him to take a piss here and pull that lever, and he dies. That takes a long time. It's lame, so I skipped over it. All right. So, uh, I guess these guys are all from, like, the south or the west or something, but they don't really talk like it, right? I mean, this guy's got one of those southern tie things on. I don't know what to call him. Hearing impaired. Where's the guy they call Birdie? And what about that bald son of a bitch, huh? Oh, that's us. Start talking. Please. I don't know about any Birdie. Ah, shit. Okay, I'm gonna count down from ten. Ten. Nine. I'm not really good with counting. Yeah. Nice. Alright, that's two down. I like to try to shoot that guy so he falls into the pit, but don't always succeed. Now, there's one last guy we gotta take care of here. And he's over here waiting for us to kill him. There we go. I'm just gonna toss this bottle over here. Mine through here. I understand. And I'm just gonna fix this gas pump here. There we go. Wait. Yeah, the locals aren't talking. Yeah, they gotta be covering for them. You do realize the streets are packed, don't you? Really? On you? How many lap dances? Can you throw in a uh, champagne room? Wow, it's a lot of ass. And just for finding this birdie guy, huh? Alright, you got yourself a deal. Crack a bottle and get ready to light my fire. Oh god, he's burning. Look at him, he's burning alive. Oh my god. Oh, the humanity. <laughs> wow. Yeah. And they sure are excited about a man burning to death. <laughs> yeah, so that was it. That was Hunter and Hunted. I wonder why they didn't do the burning thing. I mean, they didn't really think people wouldn't look at him burning, did they? Uh-oh. Looks like you may be gone. Maybe we're too late. <laughs> Birdie, where is he? You owe me a coffee, asshole! Uh, there you go. He left with this cowboy guy. Real nasty-looking piece of work. They were going downtown, I think. All right, let's get in this fucking bus. <laughs> what? Oh, it's, it's got a coupe on top. It's a school bus Too with a bird coupe on top. What? I gotta do what I gotta do. <laughs> oh man, you fucking snitch. Tell me, Mr. Wade, what would you rather do? Find a girl? Or waste a bullet? Please, waste a fucking bullet. Fuck Clock's that guy. Ticking. Fuck that guy, you fucking snitch. <laughs> Alright. Oh boy. That sure was a long level. A long ass level. It's hot here in Boston, so I'm sweating my ass off. Had to turn off the fan so it wouldn't interrupt my lovely voice. Alright, so there's quite a lot of things to do. Especially in Chinese New Year. Um, that's a it's a great place to to make contracts in. Um, fire him. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. A lot of stuff. So, 
I want all of you to stay tuned for the extras coming up. Uh, if there are any. If there aren't, well, that's just the way it is. I'm Nick Meister. I'll see you next time. Time to regain focus. According to Birdie, strip club owner Dom Osman is Blake Dexter's informant. He put the arms dealer on Victoria's trail. I will remove him from the equation before he causes any more damage. Personal note, Birdie did not give me this information out of the goodness of his heart. He has much to gain by Osman's death. This is a fragile alliance. I have to tread carefully. Keep your heads down. Keep your heads down. Hey, Keep your you. heads down. See anything over there? Run! Get out of my I'll way! Oh my God! Get out of my fucking way! Get back away from this guy! He's just closing his fucking space. Your bitch is gonna run out of here! Get the fuck out of my way! Get out of my way, you fucking bitch! God damn it! He's in a costume.